Happy Wednesday, everybody. David Kirsch here, honeycomb.fit. We're gonna do a booty butt cam, but not just a regular booty butt cam. Today, we're taking you back to school. We're taking you back to Kirsch's Butt Academy. Here's the deal. 30 years of butt shaping, sculpting, toning, examining on the outside. Um, women have come to me and they said, hey, I want a bigger booty. B, help, my butt's too big. C, my butt's flat and my hips are wide. What do I do? So, I'm gonna break it down into three series. We're gonna start with, hey, I want more junk in my trunk. Four exercises, 30 seconds, each exercise repeated three times. That's series one. Are you ready to go? Get ready for the boot of your life. Here we go. Take the music up. For the Bigger Butt Series, we're going to do ski squats, narrow stands, more focused on the quads and on the glutes. We're going to do sumo squats, getting outside here. We're going to do squat holes, get ready to fry. And last but not least, we're going to do jump squats. 30 seconds starting now. My core is going to be tight, my brain, where is my brain going to be? In my butt. I'm shutting comments off. Bonnie, Susan, Uncle Joel, Kate, Mom, I know you're all there. I love you. Good morning. Here we go. Keep your head up, core tight, brain back in your butt. Nice and deep. The closer I stand, the more I'm focusing on my quads and on my glutes. Five seconds. Get ready, open up that stance. Core tight, take it down. Working the outer part of my butt. I feel it every time I go down. My butt. Oh, that's it. Remember, mind and body. Rain back in my butt, my core is tight, my shoulders are back. I've got my Killigo Killigo cut on today, my weighted athletic clothes. Oh. Alright, here we go. Squat holes. Weights here, weights on my hips, my glutes. Turning and burning the fat, burning up the calories. Oh my goodness. Woo. What I'm talking about, brain in my butt. 10 seconds to go. Oh. Shake it out a little bit. Squat jump. Remember, these moves can be modified if you can't jump. Reach down, don't leave the ground, just keep your body moving and visualize that big, round, firm butt. Oh. Round one. Never thought of butt. I wasn't able to shape, tone, Go down, ski squats. I'm able to get down lower now. My core is tight, brain back in my butt. Again, modify, 
Arms range of motion is totally fine here. Sitting back in those heels. Hopefully you guys are doing this. If not, it's going to be living on the IGTV. It's never too late to have your best body. Wide stance. I'm going to turn it out here. A lot is going on here. And down, squat. Weights in my heels. Bring this back down here, long part of my butt. Show the edge of that smile, Susan. Butts. Yeah. They come in all shapes and sizes. So you want to enhance what God bless you with. But I never met one I couldn't perfect. Huh. Squat holes. Halfway there. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Oh. Halfway there, landing in my heels. Round two done, one to go. So much harder than this. Feel like you're caught raising my metabolic rate, my heart rate's up, but I'm sculpting, burning. Oh, this is it now. Sitting back, I'm on that mountain. I need tight glutes, strong core, and my quads. 10 seconds to go, and every set I do, I'm able to connect more with my butt. Go down a little deeper. <sighs> Why stand sumo? Core tight, shoulders back. Remember, posture range of motion, okay. Working my inner thighs and the lower part of my butt. So effective. Anywhere, anytime. You're in my living room, New York City, Wednesday morning, 10 seconds to go. Oh boy, this feels amazing. Okay, last set of jumps. Huh. Halfway there. Three sets, big booty. How's your butt feel? I know mine is definitely engaged. My quads feel great. Big booty, man. You gotta sweat it, you gotta rep it. Connecting mind to your butt and visualize that butt that you want. It's there, you can do it. Catch my breath for one second. I'm gonna have a quick sip. Uh, to the follower that can't get your inner thighs and butt sore, you gotta make sure 
you're sticking your energy back in your heels and as much as you can when you squat down squeeze from your hamstrings and your glutes and your inner thighs like you're breaking walnuts think about that that's where you want to do it right get out of your quads it's got to be inner thighs and butt all right so we talked about the next series we address the I want more junk. Now, you got too much junk, what are you gonna do? So for the next series, four exercises, reverse crossover lunge, lateral band walks, step ups, and lateral lunges. That's how we're gonna do it. You ready to go? Let's do this. Here we go. Okay, reverse crossover lunges. I'm gonna move right back. Take it right back. Alternating sides. Working my outer thighs, working my butt. But it's lifting, toning, and sculpting. My core is tight. I'm halfway there. Anchoring into my front heel. Four. All right, I'm to come back to that because I don't have my band with me, but we're going to go right up to step up. Watch your step. That was not a good, that was a misstep. Sorry, guys. Right there. Mind, body, butt, core. Stay focused on what you're doing, otherwise that's what's gonna happen. It's okay. You trip it up, you can back, back up and do it. Here we go. Nice and tight. Good, I love working. All right. Lateral lunges now. Coming right here. Sitting back in my heels. Really totally sculpting, not making it bigger, making it higher and tighter. Halfway there. Five. Quick pause. Here we go. All right, the band right around my feet, shoulder with distance, and I'm walking. Get it all set. tight all back here in my butt but instead of making it big it's making it tight small steps very different from big butts right now we're shaping and toning lifting tightening hold that last one and let's take it up Timer. All right. We're going to repeat. Get ready. Set two. Series two. Smaller butt. Let's truck in your truck. Let's go. Reverse crossover. Get right into the rhythm, right into the groove of what you're doing. Anchoring in your front heel. So good. All right. 
right. I'm gonna hold this weight now. A little added weight, 20 pounds for my step ups. Steps are so good for your butt, hamstrings. You don't need weight, but I've got it, so I'm using it. 10 seconds. Land in my heel. And lateral. Step in my heels. Very different feeling than bigger butts. Here I feel my abductors, my inner thighs, and I feel my butt going higher and tighter. And the visualization is different also. Okay. Alright, here we go. Opening it wide. down five seconds <sighs> fighting with the back I have one set to go. Five seconds. Here we go. Nice and reverse crossover. Take it down. Remember shaping, toning. My group medius. Higher, tighter, rounder. Just a little less prominent. Five seconds. You can do this. <sighs> Lateral lunge. Staying here, sitting back in my heels. See that my knees are in line with my heels. Ready, at five seconds to bend up. Five seconds. I did it. Here we go. Make it count. Rain here in my butt. Watch what's going on here. Back here. Core is tight. Shoulders are back. Five seconds. Visualization is so important, right? I'm finding that if I focus on affecting the change I want to make, every repetition is so much more impactful. Oh, two sec. Two sets down, one set to go. I'm gonna take an extra second. Alright, get set. Third set is the charm. 
my top heavy, I let it down. See me shining, they hating on me, they mean mugging, I let them down. She call me Poppy, I'm popping. We're gonna be stepping into it. Happy, I'm nice down. and deep. Talks, I'm not rushing through boys, because they my talk, body, they rain in my butt. Affecting, sweating, visualizing. Lateral lunge. I just stay on this side. Inner thighs and butt. Here we go. I've been all in the trenches. I've been all in my bag. You be all in my business. No, they notice me flexing. Fit it all in my For those of you that ask me about walking your stairs, you're definitely working your butt. But you're definitely working your quads, your hamstrings, and your core too. Remember, all the exercise, you're supported with good sleep, good nutrition, good hydration. Here we go. He got stretch marks. My neighbor swerved it. I'm hustling like might as well, bro. Fifty thin. I might live around the city. Counting. Delivering extra focus right here on the bottom part of my butt. Check it out, right here. Oh, so much harder with my chillier cut off, but I know I'm sweating, burning calories. Oh my goodness, goodness gracious. Alright, we have two series down. My butt is bigger because I wanted more butt in my, more junk in my truck. And yet, it's tighter, higher, firmer. Gravity? What gravity? I just lateral lunge that away. High, tight, perk, and perky. All right, catch your breath. Please catch your breath. How many days a week should you be doing legs? Two to three days a week. I would say one day is heavy day. I have weights here. I'm not showing you weights right now because you know what? We're at home, united together. We're on honeycomb.fit. And who doesn't know already that in an hour and a half, I'm gonna be raining my beautiful friend, Flip Tyler's Instagram account. Yes, yes. I'm gonna say pretty please let me in. And we are gonna do one of our famous beautiful workouts, mind and body. So please, if you can, 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, come to honeycomb.fit, join me, and watch what Liv Tyler and I do and what we've done for over 20 years. More than anything, a deep, loving friendship. All right, so last night, when I was doing this, when I was focusing on this workout, I got a question. I give up. My butt is flat and my hips are wide. And I remember when I wrote the butt book, there was an animated illustration, and we, you know, animations, you, you want to over-exaggerate it. And it sort of looks like this beautiful woman had been, had gone, been gone over with a steamroller. Um, and it's frustrating, right? Because, you know, your, your, your hips are wide, but then there's nothing filling out of pants. So I'm going to show you four exercises that you're going to do as a circuit. Four exercises, 30 seconds. We're gonna repeat that series three times. We're gonna go way past, but you're gonna get extra credit for this school, right? Because look, Booty Butt Camp is not just about dancing and sweating, although I love to do that, and we'll do it at the end, 
It's about learning what works for your goals. Right? You want more jump? Series one. You want less or you want to tighten that jump? Series two. If God bless you with a beautiful soul, hips and a flat butt, here we go. We're gonna do wide stance squats. We're gonna do walking lunges. We're gonna do Bulgarian squats. And we're gonna finish with glute bridges. Are you ready to go? Let's do it. Now is the time. I'm prepping out, I'm prepping out here. i move my stuff out of the way. We have five seconds, wide stand squats, and I'm gonna add a little toe action going. Go, more tight. I'm working on my medius, right? So I'm working on building right here, right where I'm holding. So good, squeeze it up, squeeze it up. Inner thighs too, double, double benefit. Twice the pleasure. Inner thighs, my core is tight, my shoulders are back. Kershey Academy, no walking through the motions. Uh, okay, I'm gonna come back here and get ready. Because we got some walking lunges. And you walk as far as you can, and I'm gonna walk back now. And I'm gonna walk back. Right, if you have more room, Take as many steps as you can, five to 10. Right now I'm focusing landing, nailing in my front heel, two right angles. All right, split squats, getting ready. The wider I go, the more I'm gonna work. My hamstrings and my glutes and not my quads. Core is tight. Next time out, I'm gonna do the other leg. Okay, group bridges right here. Right down and lift it up. One, two, three. Now you can add weight, you can add a band, and maybe I'll add both for the next set. Squeeze and squeezing, making it rounder and tighter your butt. Five. Okay. What do you think? I'm gonna keep this here because I'm gonna use this for my glute bridges. Here we go. Out wide, core tight, wide stand squats. Landing in my heels, watch what's going on here. Right down, lifting it right here. I'm visualizing a rounder, firmer, more substantial butt. You can do it, I've done it. I'm not gonna shout out the famous people who had no butt and owe their butt to a good cursing. <laughs> All right, walking lunges, take it back. Such a great exercise for toning and for building. Taking it back again. And come right back. Get a couple more. All right. Here we go. I gotta stop this side. I don't wanna be lopsided. Right? Take it right down. Driving through my anchor heel, right into my left butt cheek, butt and hamstring. Halfway there. Whoa. Good set. 
seven. Nice. Okay, quickly. I don't have that much time. I'm gonna come up here. That timer is unforgiving. Here we go. Oh, added weight, 20 pounds, and a band. The band really forcing it out of my glute medius. And squeezing, and toning, and sculpting. I've done it with barbells. If you looked at my story this morning, I did it with a lot of weight. But you can focus and do isometric, and it's very, very effective. Oh. All right, round two is over. We got one more round. We're going over today, but you know what? It's okay. It's okay. Gershi Academy. Last set. We got wide stand squats. Core is tight. I'm going to take it down lower. My knees are pressing out as I go down. Partial range of motion if I need that. Pushing through your heel. When I look at bodies, women's bodies, I don't only look at the butt, right? All the parts have to symmetrically align. But look. All right, walking lunges. I'm gonna take it right back. I'm gonna stay right here because I wanna, I really wanna stay focused. Back and forth. First with my right leg, and then I'm gonna come back with my left. Here we go. Stay right there. And pulse it out the last few. Okay. All right, we're gonna do 10 each side here. That's it, two. Huh. Last but not least. We're after school, guys. We're in detention now. No music. We're just focusing on our perfect booty and up. This could be 150 pounds right now. And I'm focusing every muscle fiber in my glutes, in my hamstrings, my glute medius, and I'm gonna pulse, pulse, pulse. Dumbbell drop. Huh. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, you just attended Kershey's Booty Butt Camp. So whether that butt is big and round and you want more, you want less, you're flat and wide, these 12 exercises, 36 sets, almost no rest. If you want to add some weight, you can add some weight. If you need partial range of motion, that's good too. Remember, we control the power and the destiny of our bodies and our lives, right? So reach deep down, put your brain down here, and know going into this exercise or any exercise that you can accomplish anything you set your heart, mind, and butt too. Not too old, not too out of shape. Build up the stamina, build up the confidence, and I know you can do it. I want you, I want you to tell me in comments what you thought of this butt boot camp school. A little different, right? 
maybe for a little warm up now. I'm just gonna be a little. All right, so I went a little past, but so what? No one has come up at nine, 10 o'clock. I'm gonna shower, I'm gonna have a little bite, and I'm gonna get ready for my friend Liv Tyler. 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm raiding her Instagram channel. Come visit us on honeycomb.fit. This workout and all the workouts we do, Stacy, Tracy, Mark, myself, on IGTV on honeycomb.fit. This is the place. This is the time to be all you can be. I'll see you in a little bit.